As you may or may not know, October is Cybersecurity Awareness Month. So at BIS Technology Group, we're going to do a series on some tips that are very common sense and really very highly needed in your business network. The first one is going to be on sandboxing. And it's kind of a, a term that a lot of people don't know about, but basically I'm going to talk about sandboxing in your email. What happens whenever you create a new file? Say you go to the copier, you take a document, just a regular, you know, eight and a half by 11 document, you put it in a, uh, a scanner and you create a file. Well, that file is unique to every file in the world. It's called an MD5, MD5 SHA-1 hash. Well, what happens whenever the first time you send that email, a good sandboxing uh, tool that's gonna be used to filter email is gonna look at that file a little differently because it has never seen that file because it's brand new. And basically it's going to look inside that file and it's going to make sure that there's no insecure uh, links or any kind of backdoor things happening with that file. As well as not only that but the body of the email to make sure there's no external links to see. It actually checks to see where those links go and they want to make sure that those links are not malicious in their content. So again this is a uh, and this is the first one it's on sandboxing and if you have more questions about it please don't hesitate to reach out but it is really the number one way that cyber criminals are attacking us is through email 90% over 90% of successful hacks come through email it is the number one thing that you need to be doing to secure your network if you have questions don't hesitate to reach out